Tanya met Eric on Tinder, and a romantic relationship formed. After dating for a while, they decided to take a cruise together from Jacksonville, Florida to Freeport, Bahamas. On the first night of the cruise, Tanya fell to her death from her cabin balcony to the deck three floors below. When interviewed by the Bahamas police, Eric said that Tanya was sitting on the balcony railing outside their room when she accidentally fell backwards. He said he was shattered by her death. Unfortunately, there were no cameras to capture what actually happened, so the Bahamas police let Eric go and sent him home to Topeka. Now, murder on the high seas is FBI jurisdiction, so my partner and I were assigned the investigation. And when we toured the ship, I went to the actual cabin that Tanya fell from, and I went out to the balcony and saw that there was no way on God's green earth anyone would ever choose to sit on that railing. So my partner and I flew to Topeka to interrogate Eric. And on video, he told us after about 45 minutes that he and Tanya had gotten into a horrible fight the night of her death. He said that during the argument, he grabbed her by the throat inside the cabin and walked her backwards until she was up against the balcony railing, lifted her up by her throat, and threw her to her death. He blamed alcohol and the fight, saying that he was in a drunken rage and that she was getting on his nerves. Eric ended up pleading guilty to second-degree murder and was sentenced to 12 years in federal prison for his crime. And that's what happened. Have a great day, and be cool.